Hi guys and welcome back to the Cocktail Vlog. Today I'm going to show you how to make the Good Ship Aperitiki. It was featured in the Australian Bartender magazine. I've actually done a few recipes out of that magazine uh, recently. They themselves adapted the recipe from the Burrow Bar and I've adapted it slightly so who knows how similar it is to the original recipe. The key differences that I've made, uh, I'm using just MGC, Melbourne Gin Company Gin, uh, which is a dry gin as opposed to Hendrix, so it doesn't have that uh, cucumber and floral notes to it. They chose to use plantation pineapple uh, rum, with those I'm using El Dorado. So apart from that, the ingredients from Australian Bartender Magazine is gin, campari, punta mess, a rum, and your falernum. So 20 mils of gin, 20 mils of campari, Then 15 mils of Punta Mess. I'll leave a link in the description below uh, to a few details about uh, Punta Mess and Campari so you can read up about it if you like. And I've got 10 mils of rum. So this one's a 12 year old rum, so an aged rum. Ten mils of rum. That first pour was a little bit too much. Followed by seven and a half mils of falernum. So this one will add a lot of spice to it. So food cocktail shake with ice and give it a good shake. So there you have the good ship aperitiki from the Baro Bar. Cheers. Quite bitter. Uh, you really get that punta mess coming through. Uh, it's quite strong. Um, if you like bitter drinks, you, you'll like this, but I think it needs a little bit of tweaking. Um, in saying that, I've changed some ingredients along, so, I'd have to play with it myself, but uh, thanks for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe, and I'll see you tomorrow. I'll see you soon for another cocktail video. Cheers.